Oh, eek. I don't think I've ever been so barefaced in front of the camera before, but... Oh well, this is the 60-year-old me. While my face is dry, I use a facial razor to get rid of all that pesky facial hair. Mustache and beard isn't a good look. Then a good cleanse. I use whatever I happen to buy. I've tried so many moisturizers, but I found this Diadermine Age Supreme is the best for my skin, and it's very inexpensive. I like to let the cream sink in a while, so we'll do some multitasking. My favorite specialist dental assistant told me to brush my teeth for at least three minutes, so I do three and a half. Oh, how boring. Now to primer. I'm using M. Assam Magic Care and I love the feel of it. It doesn't exactly make wrinkles disappear, but it smooths things out a bit. And now the best part, foundation. Again, I've tried so many from all price ranges, but I keep coming back to this. Wet n Wild Photo Focus Matte in Classic Beige. It has good coverage, spreads nice and easily and isn't cakey. And my face doesn't feel or look like it's been plastered. Right, now the eyebrows. If you are like me and were a teenager in the 70s and early 80s, then you know the motto was, pluck them to death, girls. If I knew then what I know now, just look at those natural eyebrows I used to have. This step I would normally do after my eyes, but for the sake of this video, I'll do it now. This is where I don't compromise. I've used Clinique Super Powder Double Face Makeup in Matte Honey for years. It's not exactly low priced, but it is extremely long lasting and I really love the finish it gives. A small amount of blush to finish off. I found this great Max Factor Compact Blush in Alluring Rose. It's sort of pinky gold and I just add a little above my cheekbones. Finally, a touch of lip balm to keep my lips nice and soft. And voila, that's my basic face routine.